been the head coach at Trinity for 16 years. We've been to the state championship 13 out of those 16, and we've won 11 in my tenure here. Late. Late. And I was having a hard time celebrating those victories because after games, all I wanted to do was find some place to sit down and get the weight off this thing. And it came to a point to where I wasn't enjoying what I was doing. The same day surgery thing really, really interested me because of several reasons. Health wise, the quicker you're out of a hospital, the less likely you are to have infection, the more comfortable you are. And just being able to go home in the same day for major surgery, that really intrigued me. The procedure itself is different um, in the aspect it's an anterior approach hip replacement. So all that means is that the hip is approached from the front of the joint versus approaching it from a posterior or back of the joint. But there's a significant difference in the short term recovery and the speed of walking without a walker, walking without a cane, and pain. I was pretty much back into the flow of, of everything at work in three weeks. The greatest thing was is I'm exercising, I do 60 minutes of cardio a day. I'm able to walk again. So I let patients return to golf, tennis, horseback riding, working out in the gym at six weeks. Once we get out to three months, when I consider a person 100% recovered, uh, we start allowing things like jogging, basketball, snow skiing, water skiing, wakeboarding, higher impact activities. The patient needs to be under 65 years of age, um, non-obese because the larger somebody is, the more difficulty they have mobilizing after a, a major surgery like joint replacement. And they have to have proper um, uh, family support at home to help them in the first day or two after surgery. Very excited to be able to enjoy the victory. Uh, in the past when the hip was healthy, uh, it was kind of known that the head coach would dance a little bit in the locker room. No cameras allowed though.